Hello, this is Mike, nostressmike.com. Um, thought I'd share with you, I'm, uh, uh, I'm trying a new thing uh, with my, uh, uh, what do you call it, uh, handles on my, um, my tools. But anyway, I, th I thought I would share it with you a little bit, what I've been doing. And, yeah, let's see. Uh, Talk a little bit about it. Uh, I've already shown you how I use these things, so that's why I thought, well, this sort of makes sense to you if you know how I use them. But this right here is to protect the handle when you're chopping, if you're using wood and you know, chopping wood or something like that, uh, that'll give you some extra protection. But that, that's what I got on there. And on the handle, uh, I got it down to the handle. Now, um, Let's see how we're going to do this. I use it like this mainly. and uh, But at the same time, if I would need power, so you see how it, it, uh, it slides, your handles slide down, and it stops right there at the leather. So, uh, And like I say, for how I use these things, that's why. And another thing, if you really want to get into uh, uh, a lot of power, you just slide your hand on down to the end, keep your finger around there, see the finger will, will stay on there like that. And now it's longer, so you've got more power. Uh, so that, that's what that is. And uh, so I've done it on that one. Now this tomahawk is a, a thinner handle. And uh, you see, but I still did the same thing. Put the for protection, and then there's the end. And like I say your hand slides down and stops right on it. And then uh, the same thing. You can go, and this one here is longer than the other one. And you can say the same thing. Come down, let your finger get caught on there, and you can get a good grip. Um, the um, the paracord used for um, uh, binding it together uh, really good. Uh, I mean, you really get a good grip on there. It works really well, really well. Now, I'm not sure, um, like I say, I've just made them. I haven't really used them yet. Um, but I used, I used to have power, the paracord on the handles. And under a lot of stressful work, it could un come undone. And so, and then also while I was working in the fires, and uh, like I say, I had it around the head up here, and it melted it. So that's why I thought, well, I need to do something a little bit more tougher. So that's what that's what gave me the idea. And then uh, I even tried it here on my uh, machete, and I say this is for work, uh, working machete, and. Uh, so same thing, you got it, you, you can get a hole and you see your finger gets caught on there. So that really helps a lot. And uh, it works well with gloves when you have gloves on there. So it, it works good. Uh, like I said, I really haven't had a chance to really put this stuff to work yet. But uh, I had to make the handle smaller, thinner, to make up for the thick leather of the handle. So, But anyway, we got that. and. This is the one that really made the difference. Um, I'm not big on the, the, I forgot what it's called, but like plastic sheaths. I'm not really big on them, but like I say, I thought, um, uh, I thought I'd try it because this, I've had this thing set up different than normal. So that's what, that's why I wanted to use this. And it was kind of a pain to get it out of the the sheath. And see now you got a little something to to grip on, and then I see it comes out really easy. And then the same thing, the finger gets caught on the top of it, so it's it's you can hang on to it much easier, much easier. I thought I was going to go on and take. Um, the handle off because it was kind of small, a little thin for my 
my my grip. So by putting the leather on there, that thickened it up real good. But uh, I say I, I wanted still something to grab onto, so that's where that part catches on. So you can hang on to it really easy now. You see, see the the stitching is where you really get get on to it. But and then like I say. It goes in. It's a lot easier pulling out now. So, but anyway, so it's working really good. But uh, I say I haven't put these to the test yet. Haven't really worked them all. I've still been working with the leather, uh, getting it softened up, um, and I had I had to make a lot of them to get the the right uh, what do you call it fit? Yeah, so it fit properly. But um, it, I'm real curious to see how this stuff is going to work um, and uh, but like I say I'm really curious I put some stuff on there to kind of waterproof it too so or water at least protect it from the water and uh, but we'll we'll see the bad thing is it um, I say this one here is my my work machete this I do real real work with this. And on the motorcycle, I got a, a thing where it slides in, and now it won't. That right there, that leather on the end. Well, it's not so much the leather, the knots is what's made it too big. Uh, so I'm going to probably have to do some extra, or some more uh, experimenting with tying. But you can see a lot of them are loose. Uh, I haven't got a figured out how to tie it yet. Uh, proper way of tying, but, but anyway... I think it's going to work. Uh, we just have to give it a try. But anyway, I wanted to share that with you. This mic, nostressmic.com.